There are over 1.5 million volunteer organizations across America, and all of them are looking for young, motivated volunteers to take up their causes. And yet, 75% of teens do not currently volunteer. But it's not like they just don't care about their community. In fact, our user study showed that 95% of teens say they would like to dedicate more time to volunteering. What's more, it's schools that have mandatory service hours. Administrators spend up to 25% of their total workday just sorting through volunteer paperwork. Well, we are the Innovators, and we have created an app to solve this problem. Our application, Community, is a unique user-friendly system of finding and tracking volunteer opportunities that bridges the gap between local schools, motivated students, and inspiring causes. So how exactly does our app work? First, users can find volunteer opportunities based on their interests and age and location. And then they can start tracking their hours using our check-in or check-out button, which automatically records the location and the amount of time they spend volunteering into the user volunteer history to ensure accuracy. The app will also award badges to users to recognize their accomplishments and add to the stickiness factor of the app. The students that have required volunteers at their schools can later share this information with their administrators using the online web portal. This is an eco-friendly, paperless system that saves hours of time. So what makes us different from all the other volunteering apps on the market? Well, unlike our competitors, Community provides these four key features. An interest and age-based search, student-specific features, a unique tracking system, and also a partnership with schools. Now, who will be using our fabulous app? Well, we plan on targeting the 22 million American teenagers and the 24,000 public high schools that they attend across the country. Within the first year, we will run an initial beta test in the Bay Area with 10 Silicon Valley schools, and after successful testing and user feedback, expand to schools and districts across the country. So how is community a sustainable business? Our app is free for students to encourage them to volunteer and to match competitor prices. Our, prim our primary revenue streams come from two sources. First, organizations who can pay to post advertisements about upcoming events. And second, schools who will pay a monthly subscription fee to cover the cost for programming the app, building the online portal, maintaining server-side operations, and marketing. Schools will use a tier-based pricing system dependent on student population. We project our revenue to be between $5,000 to $7,000 the first year, just from schools alone. Schools will be a major distributor for our application, and we plan on informing school administrators about our app through educational conferences for academic technology, such as iTeach. In fact, we have already gotten great reception from local and international school about our application. We will also implement a viral marketing strategy so that individuals can learn about our application through social media, such as Twitter and Facebook, which are integrated into our app so that users can share volunteering experiences and achievements with their friends. In the future, our plans include expanding our user base size and adding new features. Community is not just a volunteering app. It's all about creating a network of schools, organizations, and student volunteers towards the singular goal of helping good causes. And we need your investment in order to help launch our app and empower youth to take action in their local communities. Your target is to public schools, um, and you're from a private school. And I wondered about your understanding of that market and, and, the, uh, and the ability of public schools, ability and willingness of public schools to pay for this app. Hmm. Right, so our target, actually, it's both private schools and public schools, and we're hoping with, through our beta test, which also has five private schools and five public schools, that we can learn more about the pricing and things like that. And we know that public schools don't have as big of a budget. They might not want to spend their money on things like that. And we know that Adobe Creative Suite, which is um, something that includes InDesign and things that schools would like to use, is around $50. And so we really want to just do our beta testing, figure out our pricing and things like that. Also, um, we found out that since 25% um, of the workday is spent on this volunteering paperwork, if we think about the salary that um, an administrator would be spent for that amount of time, 
compared to the monthly prices that we're offering, there's a really big difference. So our prices are pretty nominal. In that so um, what features um, do you think are missing right now? Like what would you like to expand um, that for your app to be able to offer if you, if you won? Uh, yes, and we do have future plans to make more features. And one of them is um, making a feature to match um, people who want to donate with charities so that they, it's easier for them to find places to donate to. But we also want to add um, reflection logs for students because after students um, volunteer, we would like for them to have a forum so that they can talk about it or they can share with their friends like their experiences just to invite more people in to, to volunteer.